We are coming to you live from Arrow in Your Head Stadium in Carcass City, Missouri. And fans have been partying and tailgating all day long by filling up on their major food groups, beef, pork, Budweiser beer. And jello salad with Mini Newton marshmallows. It's the best, Grim. Simply delicious. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Mellows Hellboys take on the Carcass City Creeps. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's a beautiful day for MFL football. At least in the booth with the AC, personal servants, and blood shield. Hi, Grim Blitzer here with you, along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. How are you guys doing? I'm doing that little hottie who works the deep fry at the concessions. He said how, not who, you idiot. Even if you got the answer right. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And the runner is moving crazy fast. Look at the path he's taking up field. Yeah, he's taking a psychopath, Grim. Just make it up yourself. Yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good, Rick. Thanks. <laughs> Some yards with pinpoint passing. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. Rumbling and stumbling, he could go all the way. And it's first and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And that'll bring up third and one. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Talk about 
Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and 10. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Third down and three. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. And the ref just called a bullshit penalty. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> you know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Oh, no good. Now that punter's gonna find a cutoff bison hit. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Second down and five. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot, 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 hot. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot, hot. And he just slipped away like a greased pit. Oh, man. He just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, he should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one. Hot two. Hot, hot. Caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. And move the work feet during Frick. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Look, these guys need to talk to the ref about those calls. And by talk, I mean stomp him into the ground. And offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. Hot. Hot one. Hot. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shot by like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the frayed cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is... Ah, I forgot my point. Now the defense called a time warp dirty trick, negating that play completely. The offense is pissed. Well, I wish I had that trick in the elevator with me earlier. I, I let one rip. I mean, a really good one, Grim. And then the doors open and the team cheerleaders get on. <laughs> That's when small talk is really put to the test. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Boom! Third 
third and one. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he's off to the races. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot three. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. It's a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second down and six. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Oh, look at that freak go! He's unstoppable! Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yes, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. <laughs> Splits the upright from this far away, Bricks. If he does it, they're gonna split his skull wide open. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> they 
They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. Anyone in the mood for mutant tartar? And they're catching up. Joke, job, go shopping. Bam! Oh, man, that's the end of his day. He might want to try hurling those traps next time. These aren't just regular aliens. They are criminal aliens. And they have a lot of moves besides dancing. And a rest that it checked the wallets. Why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, he's talking about points. And they run it in for two points. And this guy has quite the female following. Listen to them. Yeah, they all want to jump his bones. I must have been a linebacker when I jumped his bones. I just lost the saw bucket that way. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Glenn, will you tell the interns to get us some franken dogs and a couple of beers? I'm dry over here. I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, at least they can pee for me, too. Caught for the first down. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Talk about Butterfingers. He should have had that one. Second down and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. That's a nice catch for five yards. The defense calls their first time out to save some clock. I save clocks too, Grim. My wife hates them. They take up the whole garage. Wait. What, you're married? Mm, it's complicated. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Holy crap, he runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. Shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And the score!
it should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go, Don't You Eat That Yellow Snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. First down! This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think he... And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are next to begin the third quarter. You talking about them two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. Just one, just in some fun of your time. team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And he's running like a moose right now. And it's first and ten. Second down in a mile. Oh, nice hit. Third down and never going to happen. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. <laughs> well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Eight. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Third down and five. Hot. Hot one. 
Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. I mean, and anything really tastes good. You've got to catch that. Third down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Well, I want Sean Kick to make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was Tripod Jenkins. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just get the pin. It appears that the ref just received a pair of very expensive alligator skin shoes. They need to put some cement shoes on before this game slips away. I haven't worn a pair of alligator skin shoes, Grim. I heard that when you put them on, they feel just like chicken skin shoes. And it looks like the... And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Not many kickers can kick it over 50 yards in these brutal conditions. Let's see if he can do what few others can. That was like a movie trailer, Grim. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And that'll be second down and four. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Great run for a nine-yard game. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, man, he really wants it. Third down and five. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Now there are 
are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Eight. Oh, what a brutal hit! <laughs> Second down and seven. Eight. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that'll be second down and four. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Lynn. Hey. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a frog in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Second down and seven. Scrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day, because he's the one who just got wiped out. Second down and six. Yeah. The defense took one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. 
Third down, and the punter is warming up. And there's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Margaret, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You got to punt it here. Come on. Great catch, and that's a touchdown! Touchdown! And here comes the extra point attempt. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. And he picks up about six on the play. has only two linemen left on the offense and will need to play shorthanded the rest of the game. Man, I'll say big things about short people, Glenn. At least they don't look down on people. And it's first and ten. Uh, and they call a warp speed dirty. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy, and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third down and nine. We're at the two minute mark in the second half. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, with a brutal hit. 
The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. So you can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He scores! Dirty trick. The last player's a race. How did they do that? Did they go 88 miles per hour? Just ask. And that was just a bad idea from the second they said we should go for it. That is him to be said of Brick's parents. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should have. The defense has to make something happen here with one timeout left. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Three. And they run it for a couple of yards. And defense calls its final timeout. Good. John. That means I gotta deal with that grubby little bathroom attendant again. Always pushing his life savers, dirty comb, hairspray, cheap cologne on me. Hey, I'm here to take a crap. Not get ready for a date. Well, you never know. Let me tell you, getting shocked is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shed carpet for eight hours so I could shock my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel and got pulled across the room into the deer antlers. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Ten-yard pick up there. Normally a first down, but here he's just making up ground. Yeah, like the way the commission makes up news. Third down and a pussy hair. I don't remember calling 911, but the SWAT team is out in full force at the line of scrimmage. Nice play by the linemen. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. Well, he gave it his best, but it wasn't good enough. Yeah, what a putz. They should have gone for it. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Ah, we are, Grim. He refuses to go down. Second down and more than the QB would like. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Five-yard gain on that pass play. Hey, look at the coach. He's picking his nose. The Creeps add a few more carcasses to their city and win the game. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm-mm, good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...